Hello and welcome to the first in a series that we've created to explain how to use the MT4 MetaTrader platform. And what you see here is very typical once you've downloaded and installed the platform either to your laptop or to your desktop. And you will typically see this sort of arrangement with four charts. It may vary slightly depending on the broker that you've used but this is a typical layout that is the default arrangement when you first open the MT4 platform. Now you can think of the platform really having six key areas, six components if you like. Up at the top left we have our primary navigation. And here you can see we have File, View, Insert, Charts, Tools, Window and Help. And immediately below this level of navigation is our toolbar. And on the toolbar you can see we have a series of shortcut icons. These are all shortcuts to do things very quickly and very simply. They're all extremely handy and I'll be showing you how to use them all in a, one of the videos later in the series. Immediately below that is what we call the market watch window. This is in the market watch pane on the left hand side there. And this is where you find all your currency pairs or the other instruments that your broker provides with the live bid and ask prices and the various symbols. Below that is something called the navigator. And the navigator is where you will find indicators, both proprietary and standard. And it's also where you manage your accounts, where you can log in, where you can add multiple accounts, and also where you can add expert advisors to your charts. At the bottom, we have something called the terminal window. And the terminal is an, an important area of the platform because this is where you will find all your trading information, your trading account history, and also some other aspects of managing indicators, which again, we will explain later in the series. And finally, of course, in the middle, we have our charts. We have four charts here. And as I said earlier, this is very much a default arrangement. So those are the six primary areas of the MT4 platform. And I'll be covering them all in detail. And one of the things you'll notice as we go through this series is that with MT4, there's always a more than one way to achieve a task. It can be done very simply through the toolbar. There are various ways of doing it through the menu options. And as you'll see, there's lots and lots of different ways to achieve the same thing. But in this series, we'll try and keep it simple and guide you to what we think are the quickest and easiest ways to get you up and running fast. So I hope you've enjoyed that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video and bye for now.